Our visit to Ngomi was incredibly profound, way beyond any expectation. Um, I'd heard about it for a few years before I eventually got there, and it was just by chance that we were on our way to St. Lucia, and we were traveling along the, the Freyheit and Ngoma road, and we saw this little sign at the side of the road, um, Marion Shrine, and I just knew that that was the place that I'd heard about for years and years. And it's, it's so understated. It's a little, little sign, and if you didn't know what it, um, what it meant, it, you would drive straight past. Entering the place, um, this incredible peace came over me. It holds an incredible frequency of unconditional love, of acceptance, of holding, of nurturing. And while down there, while down at the stream, um, I got a feeling of almost like a networking because I have been to other areas in the world where Mother Mary has also been sighted, visions of Mother Mary, and not only Catholic places. She doesn't only belong to Catholic Church, but all, all religions. And in fact, she is called the Mother of all nations. Nongomi symbolizes um, healing through water, through with in conjunction with the energy of Mary. The the premise is that if you drink of those waters and you have faith that you will be healed. I'm getting some new information here. While interviewing Brenda for the program, something remarkable happened. She went into an altered state as a message came through from Mary, none of which she could recount afterwards. Ngomi is a, a vortex on this earth. One of the major vortices in the network of vortices that, that are in the earth and around the earth. The frequency that is carried in Ngormi is a frequency that comes from Africa. Therefore, the water will carry that frequency that is totally in line with the frequency of the Africans and that is all races and all creeds. It is not a Catholic place, it is a place of spiritual importance. The caregivers of Ngormi and the surrounding Ngoma area have been placed there specifically in order to hold that place as sacred. The waters there contain the same vibration as those found in France at Lourdes. They are healing, crystalline, and they hold the vibration of the future for Africa. We are moving into a new dimension of energy, and those that are vibrating at a lower or denser frequency will find it very difficult to survive in this world. Whereas those that have taken on the invitation of change will exhibit less resistance. 